In this particular video, I am going to talk about a problem where we are going to print the number of times or the count of number of times required to double a number to reach a million. So in order to solve this problem, first thing is I will require a variable called as count to keep track of how many times I am doubling an input number called as num. I have declared num as unsigned long number because I am assuming that number is going to be always greater than 0 and since 1 million is a big number I could have used int but to be on the safer side I used long so that it, even if it reaches 1 million or goes beyond it there should not be a problem. First I am asking the user enter a number. This percentage LD stands for accepting a data type which is of the format long. Percentage LD is the conversion specifier for long data type. I will accept the number. Then what I will do is I will have a while loop because I do not know when this number is going to reach a million. So I need to stop doing the looping the minute the number just touches a million for the first time or crosses million for the first time. So I will say while number less than million. Okay, while number less than million, what I am going to do is I am constantly going to double the number. I am going to say number is number into 2. At the same time, I am going to say count is, I can do it like this. I can increase count by 1. Alright, now the important thing is be sure you have initialized count to 0. If you forget to initialize count to 0, you are not going to get the right result. And just to keep track of it, let us try to print the number also. So I'm going to print the number at each stage as it's going to be doubled. All right. And then finally, I'm going to print the number of times or the count of times it took to double a number. So times to double is equal to percentage hi because count is a small type of a data so i have to use the conversion specifier percentage hi so let's first try to check this program whether the syntax and all things look good so i am having a variable called number i am reading that number so as long as the number is less than 10 lakhs i am going to take the number and double it and every time i double it i am going to increase the count by one and at the same time i am going to print what was the doubled value? So suppose I enter 100,000, it will double and it will show 200,000, 400,000, 800,000 and last maybe 1600,000. And the number of times it took to double is going to be printed here. So let's try to run this particular program. All right. So what I can do is let me try to enter the number. Let's enter a small number. Let's enter 50,000 itself. All right. So when I enter 50,000 and I hit enter, you can see that 50,000 became 1 lakh, 2 lakh, 4 lakh, 8 lakh and 16 lakhs. So one time, two time, three time, four time and fifth time. So after doubling for five times, it reached or crossed million for the first time. Now I want to show you something interesting how you can do this multiplication by two using the left shift operator. So what I can do is instead of multiplying by 2, I can do shifting one bit every time by 1 to the left side. Shifting one bit to the left is equivalent to multiplying by 2. Shifting one bit to the right is equivalent to dividing by 2. So since the data type is num, let us see how this shifting works as you can also see the number. So what we'll do is I'll enter a very small number. I'll just enter the number 1. Okay, let's see how long one takes to double. So here if you see, although I entered the number one, it became 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, all the way it went up till a million. So if you count this, it will totally be 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 and 20. At the 20th time, it reached or crossed 1 million for the first time. So I hope you understood this left shift. Left shift is equivalent to multiplying a number by 